In order to ensure that the smear preparation for your unknown is of the highest quality, it's important to begin by washing, thoroughly washing, your slide. Make certain, use some soap and water, make certain that you rub it down well, and leave no traces of oil and debris on your slide. This will be really an important thing for your unknown because you'll be using a broth culture to make the smear for your unknown, and you want to be absolutely certain that it will adhere to the slide. Thoroughly dry the slide once you've washed it, and now you can actually put the broth culture onto your slide. However, before you even do that, it's important to label the slide with whatever your unknown number is, and make certain to specify whether this is your unknown A, the gram positive, or the unknown B, the assumed gram negative. Also, go ahead and draw a circle on the bottom of your slide, hopefully your circle will be better than mine, and put a focus line on the front of the slide. Remember, a focus line is not for wimps. A focus line is for those who like to make sure that they get their lab work done quickly and efficiently, because if you have that focus line to focus on, you can move very rapidly from that line and onto your smear preparation. Because your unknown will be in broth culture, it's no, there's no need to dilute further, so you do not need a drop of water for your smear. Simply take one to two loopfuls from your broth culture. In this clip, I go ahead and take two loopfuls of the broth culture. This should be plenty. Spread it around in your circle, and then you'll want to allow it to air dry. Be certain that you thoroughly air dry the smear before heat fixing it. It's also really important to make sure that you thoroughly heat fix the smear. This particular stain will be the one that is the best indicator of your unknown's arrangement. This is because you're coming out of the broth culture and because the, the cells are fresh and um, have not yet gone in, undergone any kind of treatment or aging on an auger surface. So as I mentioned, thoroughly heat fix the smear and you should be ready to look at it.